Hi, welcome to another posting of this uh, Mark II Jaguar two door wide body coupe of which I'm uh, building. This uh, posting is for the steering rack of which I uh, modified and have now fitted. So I thought I'd just do a quick uh, update on where I uh, am at with it. Uh, it's been a time since I put anything on because I broke my shoulder and I've just uh, been away due to mountain biking but there you go. Uh, you can just see the pinion owls in there. I'll come back out there like that and we'll come over the top and just have a quick look. As you can see I put the uh, this is an engine which is going to go in the black mark too. This is a, my special engine but anyway there we go. I was uh, quite limited for space really with uh, this rack. I'll show you when we get underneath um, some of the issues I've had to uh, try and overcome. Uh, the reason it's caused me a little bit of problems normally the engine mounting bracket would have been that side of the rack but because I moved the engine back 8 inches as you can see I've got a lot of space there uh, we put the engine mounting bracket in the way so even though I could bring the rack out quite a ways from the cross member um, it still left me a bit of a uh, bit of a little problem with the uh, tie arms but like I say I'll show you when we get underneath I've got a light under there already but uh, as always in an ideal world I'd have something better but there you go now uh, there's a rack mounted in I doubt if you be able to see the brackets very well there anyway if we just straighten ourselves up here a little bit you can see the angle there. I would have preferred to have had that straight uh, but like I say unfortunately requiring uh, to get the pinion into line let me just crawl under here I couldn't take it too far obviously because I had to make this more severe the angle and I didn't want to do so I had to bring it that way to the back but obviously I couldn't come too far because of the engine mounting bracket and obviously I've got an angle as well to put on it to mate, mate up with the steering column up there so it was a bit of a compromise really on what to do but it's not too severe I don't think but I've made the the brackets out of uh, 5mm stainless steel plate uh, and it's all TIG welded up I'm going to uh, take them back off and I'm going to pickle them to get rid of the staining I didn't polish it like uh, the other brackets here for the suspension but uh, yeah it's, it's coming on uh, like I say it's been a bit of a time I'm still uh, going to be still quite slow with the bits and pieces because I've got uh, some other work to do at the moment so it's uh, it's holding me back but there you go XJ8 um, Jaguar Series 3 rack and pinion fitted to a Mark 2 Jaguar onto Jaguar XJS hub assemblies V12 and there you go thanks for all the positive comments from everybody hope you're enjoying them Thank you.